with the University of Arizona have just announced new information about the center of our galaxy. Literally just uh, just announced just moments ago. News for Tucson, Nicole Costantino is live in our newsroom now with what they're calling a very groundbreaking discovery and very cool stuff here, Nicole. It is a certainly a, a, a very anticipated event. Now it has been a long time coming, but 36 researchers from the University of Arizona, that includes grad students, um, researchers and undergraduate students, professors are part of this and are involved with the Event Horizon Telescope. So they unveiled the first image of the supermassive black hole that is now at the center of our own Milky Way galaxy. So this this, so this evidence shows that the object that they thought was a black hole is, and they say it yields valuable clues about the workings of such giants, which are thought to reside at the center of most galaxies. So this event was produced by a global research team called the Event Horizon Telescope Collaboration, who one of the founding members is a researcher and professor at the University of Arizona, and she was the one to get up on stage and announce this groundbreaking news. Light escaping from the hot gas swirling around the black hole appears to us as the bright ring. Light that is too close to the black hole, close enough to be swallowed by it, eventually crosses its horizon and leaving behind, leaves behind just a dark void in the center black hole is about 27,000 light years away from Earth. It appears to us to have about the same size in the sky as a donut on the moon. So to image it, the team created the powerful telescope, which linked together eight existing radio, obser uh, radio observatories across the planet to form a single quote, Earth-sized telescope, and the name of it is Sagittarius A-star. Lots to know. Shay and I were talking about it earlier, about black holes and what it means. So very exciting if you know a lot about the science community and astronomy. And even if you don't, it's still a pretty big deal because the first black hole in our galaxy wasn't discovered until 2019. So the fact that this is already coming so far in advance is a pretty big deal. And so we'll have uh, more updates for this on what this really means on our website coming up here in just a little bit, kvoa.com. Robbie Destiny, back to you.